So as part of your practical assessments, you also do a ladder simulation. Um, you'll get a practice go first, and then the weights get put on. So I'll just demonstrate the practice. So the ladder simulation part of the assessment that you do, um, to start with you can have a practice run if you like, so just to get them get the motions, get the, the, the movement. Um, so basically the, the movement that you're doing, um, depending on how tall you are, depends on where this actually comes up to. So with myself, I generally have to start from about there. But if you're taller, it's probably going to be lower down, so you can basically use your full bicep. Um, whereas I'm sort of going from it from an angle, um, maybe why I find it a little bit more difficult. Um, if I was a little bit taller, maybe might be a bit easier. Um, but anyway, so it's going up. Your hands swap over, and then you're doing a press. Um, so you can break that down into two parts. So bicep curls. Um, obviously, it was just a pole just to get the idea of it and um, you can add weights onto that if you want um, you could use a big bottle here you could have that at the moment it's just full of water but as it you know you do a certain amount of reps um, once you feel that's it's not doing any, anything for you anymore so swap the water put pebbles in instead um, you can be doing stuff like this while you're making a brew, you wait, waiting for the kettle to boil, um, you know, just have it on the side in the kitchen ready and then as you're waiting for tea to cook, you can be doing it. And obviously the other side then is the uh, shoulder press. So that's the, the movement by itself. Um, so again, you can add weights onto the, the sides of this. Um, We've got the paint that we used before, so once you're feeling a bit more confident, push it up, and that's all to do with your shoulders. So there's various things that, that you can use. Um, when you're doing it, uh, try and have gloves on as well, um, because you will have gloves on when you're doing the simulation. Um, it's 15 kilograms in weight, um, so it's not it's not massively heavy but I wouldn't say it's really light either and I think it's something that particularly females will need to do a little bit of training for um, just so they know what they're expecting.